Today I'm going to show uh, the changes we've made to file attachments in Tickets 5.3. Uh, this is currently what uh, Tickets 5.2 and older looks like when you're dealing with file attachments. Um, basically every single file that gets attached to a ticket or a reply ends up in this box here. And it can get very hard to know which file is attached to what reply and which are the original files and who attached them um, etc. So, this is what the new version looks like. When you create a ticket, all the file attachments are shown below. Um, so as you can see here, these two files were attached when the ticket was created, and then here are some file attachments that have been created as part of the replies. Now, one thing we've found with other ticketing systems is it can sometimes be hard to find, go back and find a file. So we've got a few sort of things we've built in. One, you can now click attachments up the top here and it will list every single file attached to the ticket and the replies. So not only can you see both private uh, attachments and uh, normal attachments, you can view them, you can see who uploaded them, the size, you can click here to download them when they're added and we've built in this new live search feature so you can start typing in the name or a person or a file size even if you wanted to um, to do a search. So this button up the top here shows you every file in a ticket including the replies. We also have added this button here on the replies. So if you click on say this one here it still shows all the files but it highlights the specific ones attached to that item. So for this particular reply down the bottom here, you can see it's just highlighted, highlighted that single file. And again, the private reply, it automatically takes you to the private reply tab and highlights that, um, that file there. So it's much easier now to see who's uploaded a file, where the files come from, and the live search feature is really useful if you're after a specific file. Uh, so yeah, it's much easier now to see the files per, per reply, but also view every single file attached to a ticket by clicking this button. I think this will be a pretty popular feature. Catch up soon.